what's going on everybody welcome to the channel today if you enjoyed this review please drop a like and please subscribe down below i appreciate all the support from everybody and we have a plain gray nike air force one box my favorite sneaker of all time if you've never watched the channel air force one plain paper on the inside nothing around the backs and sides if we go to the front though this is an air force 107 lv8 in sale university gold white men's size 12 and i believe the retail on this pair was 120 us the correct price will be in text on the screen like usual and this pair released on march 29th of 2022 for like i said i believe 120 us and let's get into this pair so this is what we were looking at today and i am not complaining at all about this shoe but by how plain the box is you wouldn't expect it to be something so unique and a tribute to a special time of the year and this is for the chinese new year the year of the tiger and you probably saw that in the title of the video when you clicked on it but yeah <laughs> so all air force ones usually come in a leather material this one is predominantly entirely canvas and it's like a backpack fabric cordura it's pretty rough it's pretty stiff but once again in the white color and the way they block this i think it looks really really nice just to give you a quick look up close of the knit and the canvas on that material and it's paneled quite nicely it's pretty thick going across the upper you have a white painted midsole white air on the back and a nice bright orange midsole obviously being a tiger being orange and black on the stripes so some of the details you do have here is you have this nice satin style tiger stripe swoosh going across in this gold reflective kind of material once again satin so it has a nice little shimmer and you have the black striping going all the way up to the heel area on the back of course is the best part about this sneaker is the embroidered cat tiger in the chinese new year logo and it's stitched on it looks really nice as you can see the color the detail i think it's a really solid pair of air force ones once again air forces are my favorite sneaker of all time so as long as you do a really nice simple color blocking i'm for it when there's something special like this where they really have put together a nice little theme i'm in love with these shoes i really like them these are probably going to stay into the collection you have a satin orange nike air tag on the back with that patch and the stitched in black nike air medial side same swoosh in the tiger stripe with the gold and the black there is a look at your toe box no perforation same canvas white material air force one lace dubray in that brushed silver white laces the only pair you actually get surprisingly is a white flat lace with clear tips i would have liked to see a different color lace maybe something wild like the gold or the, the teal blue up here to match uh, a little bit of the tiger just another color would have been nice maybe even orange to throw from the outsole just i'm surprised we didn't get a pair of laces with these okay so canvas tongue going up as you can see underneath the canvas tongue is the same material you would get over here on the side of the upper you have the tiger logo with the swoosh slashing through the gold tag and a little hint of this kind of caribbean water teal blue going across the tongue lining i really like this color i'm just a fan of blue anyway you have red lining that's a little bit of a darker kind of cherry red going around here and then your insole let me get the laces out the way is a nice bright yellow with the nike air stamped in in black underneath the heel and if i bring up the other shoe you can see the same exact blocking is the same with the colors and the details there is the tiger on the back once again if you are not familiar with air forces i would suggest going down half a size i usually go down half a size all the time with them i haven't really found too many pairs of air forces that run true to size it's pretty uncommon i don't know why they just run pretty big and there's a look same loose debray same tag on the tongue sometimes they swap them and sometimes the insoles are different but these are exactly the same so no changes across there but overall year of the tiger is actually very interesting i was actually born in a year of the tiger when it was occurring so that gives a little hint to my birth year and stuff like that but i think this is a solid solid pickup i'm a big fan of them and the fact that i didn't even think about it that they had a combinate or a a common date with my birth year that's kind of cool to me maybe i might keep them for that reason too but other than that i want to hear what you guys have to say about this nike air force one year of the tiger down below do you like this one they have done some other uh, chinese new years in the past like the year of the dragon that were really really dope 
I have, fortunately do not have any of those older pairs, and I'm talking like the pairs from 2006, 2007, 2009, so we're going back quite a bit. But other than that, I thank you guys for stopping by today. I'm going to stop rambling. Let me know what you think of these down below. I'll try to answer back to everybody and get some conversation going in the comments. I thank everybody for the support. I hope you stick around. I have more content coming shortly, and I hope everybody has a great day. All right.